hey y'all welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here my name is jaji make sure you like comment and subscribe it's 6 30 and i'm about to do my little like morning routine for school because i have college i did start my channel during a pandemic so i never got to show you guys me going to school and then my first semester was done virtually but now i'm fully in person so we back and we better i was supposed to actually vlog on my first day like i told you guys in my last vlog literally like two minutes before i was supposed to be at the door my wig was in my hand like i'm talking about it was in my hand ball cap and all i was like how are we about to make this happen so i couldn't vlog because it was just a lot going on but we're here three days later three days into my second semester and we're vlogging i need to do skincare and i need to brush my teeth i'm a night before showerer and i don't need the oh i take 60 showers a day girls in the comments y'all could keep it to yourselves i don't care a lot of you guys ask me what i use to keep my teeth white so this is my toothpaste crest 3d white glamorous white it says it starts whitening after one brush and then for mouthwash i use the green their breath I'm running low so i gotta re-up on this i would either get the pink bottle or the blue bottle because i want to try the other like flavors this one kind of tastes like poison i do feel like this cleans my mouth though so i use this to kind of like clean the bacteria out of my mouth for the snowflakes to be hitting them this is what i use it's running low too i need to re-up i know at least y'all know i use it hair up so i can start my skincare routine i don't really thoroughly wash my forehead because do you guys see the lace no right we try to keep it like that i should probably be wearing like a little band or something but i'm reckless i like to live life on the edge this is the face wash that i use nothing too special nothing too fancy schmancy i just go on with this with my hands and wash my face <laughs> Been curling my hair for like the first couple days of school because i'm trying to keep the effort high because once the effort drops maybe it's not going up again like once i don't care i don't care like i will never care again like at least do your hair bro you wear sweatsuits every day like at least do your hair this wig was sent to me by eunice hair they're actually sponsoring this video so thank you so much to eunice hair for sponsoring today's video this was originally a 24 inch wig so i want to say it was like down to about my butt but y'all know i get a little scissor happy and i just love this length it just gives so natural when they're long and you cut them it's just so full and blunt i did it with my bob last time and i just listen keep me away from scissors bro because i'm gonna cut my hair but yeah like i said i'm gonna start curling this hair because this is not an easy task and i'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit more about college and everything so for starters um my camera's overheating what do i do i had to stay up the night before and literally teach myself how to curl hair so i'm not gonna lie i'm fake nice with it um don't quote me on that because i might struggle today whatever curls i come out with that day is whatever curls i come out with they gonna drop by the end of the day it don't even matter i really can't believe that i'm back to going to school again every single day good thing about it though is the maximum amount of classes that i have in a day is only two and even though i go to school every day i get out before 1 p.m every single day people's days just be starting at 1 p.m i know when i was on break i wasn't even up by 1 p.m so the fact that i'm already getting home literally like by 1 30 i'll be back in my house already and it's just like what bro the world is mine right now like like i can literally do whatever i want to do like i can still make it to the post office i can still schedule appointments i don't know i just always felt like online classes always sucked ass like and when i was going to school online it felt optional like i was just like you know what i'm just not gonna join today even one of my teachers were saying it in my class like i know you guys probably hate having to like get dressed in the morning i'm like yo why do i enjoy it i'm so much of a homebody that this is dead the highlight of my day keep in mind that i do everything from home like i do youtube that's my job i film at home i edit at home i was going to school at home having something to get up and like get out the house for it it gives me structure like it makes me feel like you know like i have a schedule like i need to go do this y'all see how these curls is looking right not all that but watch watch how it comes together my camera overheated so it's on an ice pack right now in my last vlog i told you guys that i was gonna start watching euphoria because i don't appreciate getting left out of the euphoria conversations and guess what 
put me in coach because i'm on season two actually i'm lying i'm on season one episode eight but i feel like i know enough to hold a conversation i'm really just trying to think about what i'm gonna wear because i swear to you i've worn sweatsuits every single day there's no problem with that but Listen, I kind of want to give the girls something to talk about, you know what I mean? But honestly, my effort for school is definitely not on, like, pick out a whole outfit. One of the reasons that I was excited to go back to in-school person is because... In-school person? In-person school is because you guys see how much, like, sponsored clothing I get, and I never really get to wear it anyway. So once they was telling me that I was going to be in class in person, I was like, oh, it's time to show up. But then you really start to realize, like, nobody cares. Like, in college, nobody cares what you wear. Literally, I keep my hoodie on the whole day. Like, I look like the Grim Reaper in school. Also, I don't have any friends in college yet. I don't know anybody. I go to school, and I don't talk to anybody all day. The only time that I do talk to people is because I've been to my campus like two three times last semester for my japanese quizzes and tests and everything i kind of know where some things are in my campus so like i'll see somebody that's new or just somebody that never came in last semester and i'll be like oh you don't know where to go i got you like don't play with me i'll be so confident like oh you need to know where the hole is at i got you i'm on my way there right now like, i really be dragging it i done been to the school about two three times and i think i'm like part of I don't know like I just feel like it's hard to make like common friends in college because you don't know everybody's schedule like everybody has different schedules like for instance me I leave at one o'clock but the person next to me could be leaving at three fun fact my lash tech goes to my school she does night classes because you know she getting that money throughout the day so I ain't even mad at her I say all that to say like sometimes I do be wanting to like wear nice outfits and everything but I don't want to waste my outfits and like I be wanting to take pictures I don't know nobody to take my pictures am I gonna make friends throughout the semester or is this it's gonna be like a come to school not talk to nobody get my shit done and leave type of situation which don't get me wrong i don't, I don't mind that either but hmm, i wonder another thing that i wanted to talk about i only wake up at six o'clock because my school is a really far commute by bus i know you guys are probably like jada why do you even take the bus you have a car first of all my car's in the shop because my car misfired if you don't know what misfired means look it up it's very very dangerous especially in the snow they offered me a rental but then it was a snowstorm and i'm like yo i'm so glad that i did not get that rental because i would have had to dig that car out of snow new york is not pretty right now like new york is literally ridiculous i'm just not really into borrowing other people's stuff because if something happens to it then it's on me but yeah having a car right now and living in new york is not really old peaches and cream and not to mention the fact that every single car that's driving around looks like it's been splattered in milk because of the snow the salt like it's just so much going on in new york right now and like i said i can honestly say i'm so glad that somebody's babysitting my car right now aside from that i do have to kind of look into my college parking policy because in the ubers that i've taken already to school in three days i've already spent the 75 dollars that i would have spent on my parking for the whole semester in order for me to do that i have to have my picture on my id which I haven't done yet. You have to take your picture yourself now because of COVID. I might do that when I come home actually because I bought this real nice sturdy new tripod and I might just stand up against one of my walls and take my ID picture. I actually kind of like the idea of taking my own ID picture because then I don't got to worry about them taking like an ugly picture of me and being like, oh, can I retake it? Or having to pay to retake it because sometimes schools do that. Schools love bringing up them old pictures when it comes to you graduating. You know, when they be making a little slideshow, y'all just love embarrassing people, right? So at least I don't gotta worry about that i don't have to worry about you know having an ugly picture pop up in front of everybody you know when you swipe your card and your little picture come up yeah y'all not about to embarrass me id picture looking like kim i have a wednesday schedule two classes psychology or philosophy one of those i don't know i get them mixed up a lot and then i have english i met my english teacher before my philosophy teacher canceled on monday so i never met him but i'm gonna meet him today for the first time so i don't think i'm gonna get a lot of footage in that class oh a lot of you guys pointed out the fact that my flower wall is gone and i had announced it on my spam but i forgot that i made my spam private and not everybody follows my spam because not everybody can now now it's a very selective process to get in my spam Damn. This is not a free for all. I gotta make sure you are OG. I gotta make sure you're not a hater. I'm probably gonna recurl the left side of my head just because it's not giving like big bouncy bombshell. I don't know, y'all comment down below what videos y'all wanna see too. I know y'all really like the vlogs, but it's like, 
I don't know. I feel like I do the same thing every day. And now that I'm going to school, it's like, do y'all want me to vlog me going to school every day? I am probably going to vlog again in school, but I want to wait till I'm like comfortable with people in my class. And like, you know, I'm comfortable with my teachers and I can vlog in class and, you know, make it a little bit more interesting because now I'll be like sneak recording in my class because I'll be scared. I've never taken my computer to school before just because I've never felt like the need to, especially because it's like the first days. Teachers are still going over like syllabus and stuff like that. I feel like if you bring a computer the first couple days of school, like you will show off. Like you really don't need a computer your first day. I walked into my first period of class on my first day. It was a boy with an iPad, MacBook, AirPods, Apple Watch. He had the whole Apple store on his desk just for him to put the lid down and not use it throughout the whole class from when he was sitting there. Your old dia show off. Like just shut up. Just shut up. Get out the class. Like you just made me mad. So yeah, I definitely don't think I need my computer yet. When they give me like a rhyme or reason to bring my computer then i'll do it but as for right now the ipad is cutting it i can also understand like if you want to catch up on work like in the library after school but boy what work do you have it's the third day um but anyway let me shut up because i don't know what that boy got going on in his life i know y'all probably gonna think my baby ears is a mess but i really be leaving it like this because i feel like it just gives like a uh, like a effortless like you when girls be getting a blowout and they be getting like a fresh washing set do the baby has ever really be like laid like stuck to the face laid no um so i'm about to use oh this bottle is disgusting it's the sebastian shaper plus um hairspray and i just use this it's really good and it's really cheap it's like ten dollars i found it in marshall's it also smells really good so so my hair is pretty much done i still have to brush out the curls but i'm gonna wait till before i leave to do that and if you guys are interested in this wig this video is sponsored by eunice so the links and everything are going to be down in the description the info links to their wigs best-selling wigs just like it everything everything that you need to know about this wig is going to be in the description box below and again i want to give another thank you to eunice hair for sponsoring today's video but now to pick out the outfit it's 8 11 we're definitely taking over today so now for my outfit again i just picked out yet another sweatsuit i'm gonna wear my blue pangea sweatsuit is that even how you say this i wore this in my last video but listen who cares i'm telling y'all you don't care college then i'm gonna wear my black ugg tasman's hopefully my mom decides to be a sweetheart and picks me up from school today because if i have to take the bus home in ugg slippers it's gonna be a really big issue and this is the bag that i use for school there's literally nothing in it there's like um a japanese syllabus for my class yesterday it's really just my planner my ipad and sometimes i take a notebook i think i'm gonna take a notebook today um some highlighters a hand lotion because my hands are always dry my keys and a portable charger just in case anything that i bring i forgot to charge the night before but that's pretty much it i'm putting on my shoes i don't even know what time it is i'm gonna leave by like 8 40 8 30 right now I'm like running perfect on time because I want to try to sip me a little coffee and give me a little donut. The slippers are on and how do I look? Like a damn fool. I'm not even going to embarrass myself and try to show you guys my outfit in my mirror because it's filthy. Um, my bag is also like hella linty but like I said I just packed my iPad. I have a green iPad Air. It's on a hundo two of my camera batteries are still charging i'm gonna bring those two anyway even though they're not fully charged my sd card reader because this is what i used to edit and if i'm gonna get to school early i need something to do and this video has to get edited so probably gonna do that and then for perfume i'm gonna use fruity oak moss by dossier hashtag not sponsored because every time i talk about it it is sponsored so you guys think i don't really like it but i actually wear these perfumes and i genuinely genuinely fuck with these sometimes i even bring it in my bag but i try to be a little considerate because i know don't nobody want to smell all the fumes when they in the middle of class um so i think that's pretty much it for me getting ready so we're about to head to the kitchen so welcome to my kitchen you guys are never in here because i don't know how to cook so what am i in here for but i want coffee because i need a little i need a little caffeine in my tank caramel macchiato and vanilla latte i'm too lazy to do the whole brewing coffee adding creamer so i just get the pre-made ones i actually don't have a tumbler to take it out of my house so i have to drink it while i'm here and hope that it keeps me going throughout the whole day my mother took my starbucks tumbler to the mall and left it there so if you guys ever saw a red tumbler in garden state mall sephora give it back i also took out one of these pre-made acai bowls to like thaw out because you keep them in the freezer but those are really good for the morning that's what i eat for breakfast and especially because i'm taking it over i don't gotta worry about everybody watching me we're about to head out the door because i'm gonna be late 
and I'm taking an Uber. Actually, no, because I'm going mad early, so I'm not going to be late. But I'm going to be late for being early. Mm -hmm.